Yo, what is good guys? It's your boy Jason JV back at you with another reaction video and yeah I'm a little tardy to the party with this one but hey better late than never right and uh, so as you can tell from the title down below we are reacting to Adam Calhoun's canon Lil Wayne remix so yeah guys without further ado like to hear here go Hillbillies never get stranded. Yep. Gotta give them boys credit, man. They grow up learning some real, real survival skills, man. One thing I definitely uh, gotta give props to Adam Calhoun for, man, is his values, man. This is a guy who believes that if you don't work, you don't eat. You know what I'm saying? That's a mentality that my father taught me. Hence why I'm doing this. And hey, every man's got to start from somewhere. So again, I apologize for the lack of OBS. Just give me some time to upgrade, guys. And uh, yeah, you'll get better quality videos. I assure you. You lift up your truck, but couldn't switch up your rhyme. I just came to check the rappers out here fucking up the market. Take that basic shit back to Target. It's Rappers fucking up the market, take that basic shit back to Target. Is that what he said? Let me make sure I got that right. Fucking up the market, take that basic shit back to Target. It's yep. garbage. You really out here acting like you're balling. When you 10 payments late on your mortgage, stop. Pretending that you're balling when you're 10 payments late on your mortgage, bruh. I'm lost it, I'm nauseous. Guns up out the closet. Kill a motherfucker, say we don't need no coffins. I'm spitting like coffin. You ain't listening when I'm talking. You don't get the point though. You you don't get the point though. Ball pen, <laughs> ball point pen, nice. You know what that reminds me of? Like a broken needle, kid. You're missing the point. Yeah, John Cena's old um, Thugonomics theme song. I'm I'm just saying. It's it's a similar line. I'm just saying. Speaking of, you thought I was done. I heard that he has a new album coming out called Billy Goat. I can't wait, man, because I, I, I have all of his um, previous records. I'm, I'm waiting for this new one, man. I, I'm excited for this new one. And you can sit on the couch, Facebook Live, talk a shit, getting clout. <laughs> Boy, say my name, get punched in the mouth. I yeah. Don't know how else to cut it. You ain't gotta love it, but you damn sure gonna respect that. Accept that. Red wing boots apply pressure where your neck at. Pull up up and Wu-Tang, they taught me to protect that. Mm. $5,000 on the dresser, yes sir. 100 for a show, I ain't taking nothing less sir. You just like a peasant, you ain't... Yeah, so, guys, sorry for the constant pausing, but I'm trying to avoid copyright, you know what I mean? Because like I said, I reacted to his song Racism, and um, I know I did a lot of pausing on that video, but I still got copyright claims, so I want to make sure I pause enough times to avoid copyright. Take nothing less up. just like a peasant, you ain't grateful for my presence. Hard work and effort, and I always put an extra. I'm a Billy Goat, and you just a jester. Joker, clown, get poked and found in a hole in the floor. See, he made a Billy Goat reference there. So that's how, you know, you know, the Billy Goat album is coming. Oh, won't you hold that down? You want the loudest in the room, now you don't make a sound. I'm going to hit him with the, the cannon. Dude, that's dope. He shouted out all the big name reactors. Simba and Ma High, definitely follow those guys on uh, YouTube, guys. Make sure you, you subscribe to, to Crypt as well, Art of Kicks, everybody that he names here. Here, I'll start all over. No Life Shack. No Life Shack. Art of Kicks. Julius Mafia. 
Tulip Mafia. Crit. So yeah, make sure you subscribe to all those reactors, guys. Those are those are cats that I'd be following too. You know what I'm saying? I follow all them dudes. Crip, No Life Shack, uh, Art of Kicks, Simba, uh, Mile High. Yeah, man. Make sure you follow them dudes, man, because th th those guys are the real deal, man. You know what I'm saying? Respect, respect to all the reactors. You know what I'm saying? Those are all dudes that I follow as well. Alright guys, so that was Adam Calhoun with Cannon, the Lil Wayne remix. And um yeah man, definitely feeling this one. You know what I'm saying? I can't wait for that Billy Goat album to come out, man. I know I know it's gonna be fire. Now, word had it, well I remember him doing uh, a song where um I thought he were I thought he was gonna be done. Like his last album, I thought he said that, that was gonna be his last album. But um Apparently he's got one more in him, so I mean I, I'm not complaining, man. Hey, Adam, bro, I'll tell you right now, man. If you whatever music you got left in you, bro, whatever stories you got left to tell, you know what I'm saying? Whatever bars you got in you, man. Hey, keep them coming. I'm not complaining. You know what I'm saying? If you got you got plenty of bars left in you, man. I would love to hear them. You know what I'm saying? And I would love to do a video reaction series on your past albums. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. Definitely look forward to that, guys. I, I, I do want to do a video reaction series for Adam Calhoun as well. You know what I'm saying? Because uh, this dude is definitely, definitely got some fire. You know what I'm saying? When it comes to the bars. Yeah, and I'm not I'm not just saying that because he might be watching. And I don't want him to kick my ass, alright? <laughs> you know what I mean? No, but seriously, man. Adam Calhoun, man, is dope, man. Make sure, if you guys aren't subscribed to him, make sure you subscribe to him. You know what I'm saying? And follow this dude. Link to the original video will be in the pinned comment down below. Hopefully that would also help in avoiding copyright claims. All right. I'm just saying. Okay. Please don't look my ass. Because <laughs> <laughs> he's a big motherfucker and I don't, I don't want to, you know, be on the bad side of this dude. You know what I'm saying? I want to make sure I'm doing everything right. You know what I'm saying? Everything accordingly. So, uh, yeah. Because, like I said, I'm a big fan of this dude. I actually found out about him through a, a, a mutual friend of ours. So, uh, yeah. Again, really don't want to be on the bad side of this dude, man. I love I love what he does. You know what I'm saying? I respect where, where he comes from. You know what I'm saying? I respect his values because I feel like a lot of my values correspond with his. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. You know what I mean? I can definitely relate to a lot of what this guy, um, a lot of his a lot of his values, like I said, were, were bestowed upon me by my father. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, yeah, that's real talk. You know what I'm saying? I would love to meet Adam, man. I, I mean, I would love to meet up with this dude. He, he looks like the kind of guy that you, you know, you just hang out, chill, and toss a few beers back with. You know what I'm saying? I would not mind doing that. You know what I'm saying? I think that would be pretty cool. Anyways, guys, y'all know the drill by now. Let me know down below with the thumbs up, thumbs down, how you feel about this track. And uh, feel free to provide any and all feedback in the comment section down below. And, uh, yeah, for those of you who are new... Uh, first of all, welcome. Thank you for your view, and hopefully you'll consider subscribing to the Jason JV channel so you guys can be a part of the family. I would love to have y'all. You know what I'm saying? All that fun stuff, guys. And until the next one, it is your boy Jason JV saying y'all take care, and I will catch you guys later. Peace. Unless you get on my bad side, then I'm gonna have to hit you with the cannon. <laughs>